Welcome to Art of the Drink. My name is Anthony Caparelli. We are back with Stephanie. Hi. And we are going to do a drink that I've been wanting to do for a long time. This is the Sex on the Beach. Really? Yeah, I figure the weather's getting a little bit warmer, springtime's coming. There's actually probably at least 10 recipes for this drink, okay. depending on where you go. I'm going to do the two most popular ones, at least on the East Coast. Um, and as a matter of fact, when I was tending bar in North Carolina for a long time, when people come in and order a sex on the beach, I would always ask them, where are you from? And if they said anywhere roughly north of about D.C., I would make it the way that I'm going to make it. And if they said that they were from someplace south of D.C., I would make it the way that I'm going to have you make it. Okay. All right, so I'm going to show you, the, again, the two most popular recipes here on the East Coast. People from the West Coast came in and ordered sex on the beach, and I think they were, like, actually talking about having um, sex, like, on, on beach. Venice Beach. So right. I don't know what they drink out there. <laughs> All right, so this is going to go um, in a Collins glass. Okay. all the way to the top with ice. And again, this is the northern recipe. Um, and it starts with vodka. I'm going to do an ounce of vodka, and then a half ounce of peach schnapps. And as I make this drink, and you watch the ingredients, you're going to see uh, that there's an easy way to remember what the ingredients are. And then I'm going to do half of the remaining volume of the glass with orange juice, okay. and then to the top with cranberry. So if I take the peach schnapps out, what do I have? Vodka, orange, and Madras. cranberry. Madras, right, exactly. So it's basically a madras with peach schnapps. And then I'm going to take this. And I like to, the, the juicy kind of frou-frou beach drink type things, I like to shake. Froth them up. Gives it a nice texture. Now, I don't care about frosting the tin on this. Um, I say shake to froth. So I just want the ingredients frothed. I'm going to take this put this back in the glass. Very nice. Yeah, nice. And I like to actually finish this with just a little drizzle of grenadine. For color. Yeah, for color. Kind of gives it that uh, tequila sunrise cascading effect. All right. And then, of course, we're going to serve it with a straw. And I'm going to garnish it with a flag. And there's probably as many garnishes for sex on the beach as there are recipes right. for sex on the beach. I like to do a flag. Cherry and an orange. Again, the red and the orange um, mirrors the ingredients. And that is what I call a Northeastern Sex on the Beach. Northeastern. All right, I'm going to have you make a different one. Ready to give it a try? Yeah. Good. All right. Each week, our Art of the Drink video podcast prize package will consist of a Maker's Mark apron, a copy of my Art of the Drink Volume 1 Bar Essentials DVD, and a limited edition version of That Special Touch, a Maker's Mark cookbook not available in stores. Okay, so same glass. Same glass. Same glass, ice all the way to the top. Great. And yours is going to have three quarters of an ounce of Chambord, okay. which is black raspberry liqueur, and then three quarters of an ounce of Midori. Midori, the Midori. green. Yeah, green. And Midori is melon, melon liqueur. Three quarters of an ounce. So half and half, you want to equal about an ounce and a half of liquor totally in there. Okay. And then pineapple juice all the way to the top. Yep. Yeah, great. And when I was working uh, in North Carolina at a place called Top of the Hill, uh, Tar Heel Country, for those of you who are UNC basketball fans, go Duke. I serve more <laughs> of these than I could want to admit. Go ahead. And then shake it. Right. Just shake it up a little bit. And you can serve that layer. Did you see before you yeah, the color shook it? Right. You can do that. I like the flavor of it shaken a little bit better, but it's just a variety. Awesome. Right back in. And my choice on this is no garnish, no garnish. just a straw. Fantastic. Serve it on a napkin. Why don't we go see which one we like better? All right, let's go. <laughs> Salute. That's good. Redo my lip gloss. Oh, sure. <laughs> Come on now. 
That one's good. Sex on the beach. Oh. Oh. oh party foul. That girl. What do you want? Ooh, that one is yummy. He's spilling. <laughs> she spilled. I like them both. 